Alrighty. Stream should be live once again. We are pretty much right where we left off last time in the border zone here in the Shinobi Thieves Tower. And I have gone through and just rearranged gear on everyone, thought about it, read the stats, and made sure everyone was wearing what they should be wearing. And I also took off all of the shoddy gear from everybody and the weapons that are worse than what we're currently using. So we are going to get rid of all of this stuff. And the goal for today is going to be to get at least standard gear on everybody in as many slots as we can. We might not be able to fill all the slots today, but we're going to try. So we're going to be farming bandits, selling their equipment, and then buying standard gear to uh, fill up everybody's slots. Should be pretty good. A lot of these we can actually fill up right away with at least something because we've been storing a few things that should be able to replace them this stuff. I, uh, notably, I basically made it so that our named characters are not ruining their stealth with the equipment that they're wearing. So I took off all the chain vests and whatnot. We're going to have them wear leather so that I can sneak around a little bit with our main characters. That should be good. Um, we need to get some hats for these people. I had two hats for them. They give increased perception, which is good, but uh, they're shoddy, so I really would like to get better ones. So I'm just going to get rid of them, and then I'll be reminded by their bare heads to uh, hunt down some better stuff and get that for them. That's a higher priority. Also, Flan was wearing this shirt, even though Molly should have been wearing this shirt because of the extra crossbow effect. So that's a bonus. Also, it helps that Molly is wearing this because it gives a defense bonus and there are medics. So we really don't want them going down anyway. So the defense bonus will be good. Swapped around uh, locations of people in my list, changed the backpacks around so that they made more sense, different things like that. But we are ready to go pretty much. Um, everyone's more or less healed. I'm gonna start the game moving along here again so that we can make sure everybody heals and run down to our base. I also want to set up a shop in this little house that we have so that the stuff that we don't want to keep we can go ahead and just put in a shop counter and hopefully sell some of it while we're out and about to make just a little bit more money out of what we're farming. All the loot we've been getting. I'll at least try and throw some like the standard stuff in there. Look at all this extra equipment we have. I'm going to keep the weapons because we might use some of these eventually. Uh, I don't think I'll keep any of the uniform stuff. I don't think I'll keep any of the junky armor. So I'm going to go ahead and see if I can build that shop counter right away. Was that a map that you had in your backpack you didn't right click yet? Right, yep. That is something that we bought last time and I totally forgot to right click. So all the stuff we need to deal with is in my character's inventory right now. So we'll get to that. Yeah, we got that like halfway through our last play session and I just never right clicked it. <laughs> so <laughs> I found it while I was going through everyone's gear, which is why it's important to do that occasionally. Um, shop counter right above the building materials. Shop counter, there it is. Thank you. I don't know... Uh, I guess it's this direction, probably. And we'll just put this. I don't think it matters as long as they can get to one of those sides where the uh, people icons are. Right. I think I'll put it kind of by the door here. Somewhat out of the way. Yeah. And of course, we don't have building materials. Find that questionable we definitely have some building materials somewhere there's one how many does it take probably like I think the shop counter is four four ah uh, wow okay well maybe we can buy some at the yeah, bar yeah the bar here. should have some I just don't have a, yeah grab a trader so that we have a trading backpack to deal with all that. Alright, let's right click this map while I'm waiting. 
One location added to the map. Um, I don't know what location was added. Might have to zoom in to see it until the... the there uh, we go. Yeah, there we go. Um, maybe it, it should have a green box around it if it was new. Oh. Hmm. There's ruins way up there. Holy cow. Yeah. That I mean, that might be it, to be honest. Since yeah. you opened the map and then closed it. There's it also a way station way down here. That one... This one wasn't on our map before, so... Or not that I remember, at least. A wild bull. Hmm. Uh, it's from the Nomad, so it's not really wild, but... Oh, it's just called Wild Bull. I yeah. See. Always check on the right side of that name plate where it shows the faction they belong to. Uh, um, wow, one building material? Come on. <laughs> I need two more. You have to venture down to that other bar from the rebel right. base. Um, another spring bat. Alright. Yeah, we'll go to the rebel base real quick. And the last couple people are getting fully healed while we do this, which is perfect. Please have two building materials. They're gonna have none. Yeah, they just have all this junk that we sold them last time we were here. Ah, it's lame. a little bit unfortunate. Um, I might just have. We could let someone make a run to the base. Because there might be some in the boxes there. Yeah, either run to the base or... Or stack or squin. I'm going to run to squin. With Ruka. I think that'll be fine. Actually, we'll, we'll drop off the last little building material real quick. Halfway there. Oh. We have friendly neighborhood hooligans. Make short work of them. Excellent. Got our first combat of the day in real quick. I could really swear that occasionally some of these have slightly better um, are there Hungry Bandit leaders ever? The Hungry Bandit, yeah, the Hungry Bandit leaders generally have a sword. Or a, um, oh, they have a saber, uh, you're right. Saber, yeah. Uh, so I was looking for better clubs. We need to get some better clubs. I did switch our main club wielding characters to using the spiked clubs because they deal twice as much damage, basically. So, and they have some armor pen. They're actually decent. Not great against yeah. animals, but they're much better than the regular junk clubs that we've been collecting. The armor pen does come in handy. The only downside is they're heavier. Yep, but that's okay. We'll train up and be able to use them. Um, I do think that it would be ideal at some point to try to manufacture some clubs. Right. You got one person that's good at weaponsmithing, you can make any better... make things that are better than anything the bandits are carrying right exactly honestly i could upgrade a lot of weapons if i just started doing some manufacturing mm -hmm. let's just run everyone down here will i even level sneaking if there's no one around i think people do have to be able to see you to level it uh we'll check because i would like to get my stealth up. I guess um, maybe being seen it's by your own characters counts. <laughs> yeah, it's leveling. So I guess we'll stealth run to uh, this location. It's going to take a little bit, but it will get everybody some stealth. 
And we do have some people that are pretty low. It's a valuable thing to have. Yeah, doesn't hurt. Hmm. Now it doesn't look... There must have been something near us. Because now it doesn't look like it's leveling. Yeah, that, that actually makes sense. It, it, oh, it, there's animals up here. I might actually just fight them? It says there's animals up here are somewhere. They, are they food Is animals? This supposed to be the animal pack? No. Why do I have such a hard time seeing animal groups? Uh, well, if there is an animal nest, if you hold alt, there should be yeah, some, like, I'm trying. There we go. Nest. There we go. It's bone dogs. There you go. We really uh, need food as well at the moment. So, I, yeah, we can definitely fight bone dogs now, though, right? They have high hit points. Mm. But we have way higher stats than they do. I, like, I think some people will get downed. This is a lot of pups. The only concern I would have with fighting that many bone dogs is that if you do get everyone knocked out, the bone dogs may eat your people. Right. I don't think everyone will get knocked out, though. I think it's you really can try unlikely. luring a couple of them at a time. Might be yeah, better. let's do that. Let's do that. Yeah, that's a good point. Why not just be safe? Ish. Yeah, I'll just lure them out a couple at a time. At least for like the bigger ones. So this is an adult one. We should be able to take this out pretty quick. Alright. Yeah, that, that hurt. I'm sure there's a few people with some... Yeah, Flan got yeah, bit in the stomach. Ruka took some damage. I'm actually glad it was attacking Ruka because she's got like heavy, heavy armor on. Um, I see one running over here. This will be good for our food situation. fight these two big ones. Now, I don't think there's any more large ones left. We'll just back off for a second. It's interesting. It said the nest was wiped out, but there were still a few little uh, little ones left. I guess only the adults count as part of the nest. Yeah, I guess so. Pretty good. And now we've got even more money that we can make at our next location. Yep, there's no downside to that. A little bit of training, a little bit of money. I saw some dogs running around over here, too. Maybe they were something else. And we got free food. Well, not free food, but kind of free food. Well, I mean, you just had to pay with your flesh. Mm hmm. 
Now we're going to use all of that food to heal ourselves. Uh, how about these guys? There's only two of them. Some Garus. Yeah. I sure. think that'll be an interesting fight. I don't think anyone will die doing it, at least. Probably not the two of them. That'll make sure they're just marked as herbivore. Slow this down and assess it. Ouch. This thing's a beast. They're hitting everyone around them. Like at the same time. Jeez. Alright, everyone's healed up. Oh, that's a lot of meat. And that was a small one. Yeah. Well, All the small right. ones have the same amount as the big ones in this game. Very nice. That is a good chunk of food. And some broken bones. Minor details. Oh, I need to set my healers to splint. That is something that I need to... There we go. Splint. Splint. Nice. For some reason, they weren't splinting injuries before. I think at one point you ended up uh, like basically all deleting all their jobs. Right. This looks like someone you could buy a pack bowl from. I do have 29,000. The thing is, is the pack bowl going to run slower than me? It probably will be a little bit slower, but it's generally worth that. it. You could always Why, just though? pick it up with someone. Why? So what makes the pack bowl worth it? As opposed to me just carrying stuff in all my hundreds of backpacks. They can carry a lot of stuff and not be slowed down by weight. But if they're already slower than me... You can pick do them Do I up. care? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's gimmicky. I'm not going to pick up a pack bowl with stuff on it. That's silly. Yeah. So there's pack bowls and then there's pack beasts. Yeah. Um, they, they fulfill the same purpose. I prefer bowls, but... Hmm. Are the bulls, like, tankier? I feel like the beasts, they're worth more, so they must be better, right? Maybe I'm reading uh, into that wrong. This one's just a... They're all pups. The age is... The age is probably what's making a difference in the price there. Right. Because they, cause they do have to take time to level up. Or to age up. Hmm. Um... Pack Beast was decent. I'm just, I feel like I'm going to have to micromanage it and like get my Pack Beast out of combat. And Well, if you set it to passive, it shouldn't be targeted primarily uh, by most things. I guess, maybe. But also, if you let it fight, it's going to build up toughness as it gets hit. Right. Maybe I'll take the Pack Beast. I'll give it a try. Worst case scenario, you slaughter it and you got free food. Right. I mean, it wasn't free, but it was food. No, not free, but... Um, I don't do we, know what if do we the name pack it? beasts... We need a name for it. I don't know if the pack beast uh, backpack is... It has a, like a saddle kind of thing on it. Yeah. Um, I'm going to name it... I guess it's called Garu. Uh, I'm going to call it Big Toe because it's got a real big toe. Hey, wait, he's got a lantern on him. Does that mean we oh. can uh, yeah, you'll work have some at night with my lantern? Oh, look yeah, at him. He's so cute. That's true. He's adorable. All right, Big Toe's part of the crew now. So now select him and then press I, and you can look at his backpack. Yeah, pretty big. Pretty big. Yeah, and also mouse over the backpack and check, check out what the stats do. The thing is, I can't, like, have Big Toe loot people, so I still now have to loot things with a person and then put it in my pack bowl. It well, just seems like more Well, if you loot like someone and he's nearby, you can right-click it and it goes into his backpack. Right. It just seems like more work to me, honestly. This is why I never get animals. We'll sure, but, try, like, but... You'll, you'll see when you start piling things into it. Yeah, yeah. I suppose it'll be nice for stacking something. Stacking everything, really. I mean... 
This guy always bag checks you. Yeah, I just stop now when I get to the gate and wait to you see if he's going to do gonna it. Happen. Because yeah. if I run by, then I can get in trouble, right? Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, I just preemptively stop for him now. Like, okay, do your thing. Yeah, well, the nice part about this uh, about this pack beast, too, is you could just pile in all the food and everything into it, and it, it could really just kind of hold everything. You'd hold all your building materials. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, if you ended up going back to the uh, town that you have, you could pile in all your iron plates and stuff and bring those with you. So you'll always yeah. have something with you if you need to start building. All right. This is our first order of business see if we can i really should have checked the shinobi thieves before i left but that's okay white plate jacket oh it reduces stealth interesting the black plate jacket doesn't actually reduce stealth at all because it's black dang it's I, need to buy, I need to buy everything from the shinobi thieves jeez <laughs> their gear is just in general better and it's cheaper yeah, that's true. Because the Shinobi Thieves, remember, are charging a half price for everything. Right, right. I'm kind of tempted to get a, a mercenary plate for our big giant. I think that would be... Oh, the high-grade samurai plate uh, uh, pants. The pants? Yeah, uh, there was a high-grade yeah. one he moused over. Those are very heavy, very tanky. Should I just kit this Look guy out? Look at that harpoon out? resistance. Yeah. Should I just kit this guy out and like samurai? Just stuff? make one giant heavily armored tanky dude. Yeah. Make yeah. A, make I a would. Super tank here. I would. Because then you could also set him to taunt, so he'll be uh, he can draw aggro to himself. Mm -hmm. I still haven't had any like success with that. I feel like. It does work. Uh, it's not. 85, 85, it's not 85. just like 100 percent perfect though. This covers part of your stomach. And the nice part is those uh, those pants cover the stomach too. Right. This covers some of the stomach. This covers some of the stomach. Yeah. Together, he's got pretty good coverage now, and he's got yep. a full size chain mail, and the samurai yeah. boots. So the only thing I would get is be that uh, armor now. hood for the for the helmet. The armor hood isn't better than the spiked helmet. Unless you can find a high grade one. And then it's only better because it gives you a little bit of resistance. Oh, the actual yeah, right. armor numbers are are not actually better. I think one of them might be. I think the blunt might be slightly or cutting or something might be slightly better on it. I don't remember. Does the uh does the bandit's helmet that you have on him have harpoon resistance? Uh, yeah, it's got 53 harpoon resistance. Oh, pretty good. Okay. Yeah, these helmets are pretty good. And I yeah, have, yeah, I have you're high right. grade ones good. for a lot of people. Yeah, they're not they're not bad, and they also they just reduce your perception, which I don't really mm -hmm. care too much about, honestly. Doesn't matter unless they're shooting. Yeah. Right. And his boots were his boots high grade. Uh, they were standard grade. I don't think I have high grade boots, but that's mm. fine. Standard grade's pretty good. Yeah, if you ever get a chance to find some high grade, just kit him out with like the best armor possible. Yeah, get it out of your inventory. Yeah. Then I don't have to think about it. We do need some hats. I wonder if there's a hat guy here. We have weapons, but we don't really need weapons from this location. All they have is heavy ones, and I don't really want that. Maybe the trader has something I want. Also, we need to get building materials, so that's what I really need here. Ugh. Nothing. Location no already building known. materials. Tech Hunter's map. I guess I'll take it because I don't have it yet. Already known. And map of swamps. Hey, that'll be a good one. Yeah, you could um, pack all those those really good uh, medical kits too on your, your pack bowl. Yeah, 
I don't want to overbuy stuff that I don't necessarily need at the moment. Uh, I but feel I, like you'll eventually. I am med gonna. Kits. I'm gonna replenish my supply of med kits though, and just make sure everyone has a couple. You've got plenty. You've got another now. Two. There we go. This person. Got another good one for our actual medic. And big toe. I guess I can put stuff that I want, but I don't want, like I'm not actually going to be using. Oh, he can't come inside. Or is he just lagging behind? He's just lagging. Oh, he's still over on the other side of the city. He's just lagging over. behind for some reason. Buy all the books. Maybe those two big splint kits too, and hang them, hang on to them. We already have three. You have one, and both of our medics have one, and they don't seem to get used hardly at all. We'll get one more for this medic because it's like half used. But we, yeah, also, we really good. don't seem to use them too much compared to how many we have. Yeah. I was hoping to get building supplies here, so maybe the bar has some. I don't know. Yeah, Big Toe can't go inside, so that means in order to trade stuff off of Big Toe, I have to pick it up, bring it inside with somebody mm. else. No, usually the range for those do actually reach from like, outside. Okay, yeah, I can't actually do it from this one, so that's not bad. We're not going to buy food, we're going to cook food. No building materials, what is this? Hmm. Gosh, dang it. Ugh. Oh, here's a trade station. Okay, this place will have it. Hopefully. Okay, there we go. Building materials. Now, if I put the building materials on this guy, will my guys know that they're there? <laughs> and go no. grab them? Ah. No. So there's another mark against it. <laughs> I have to get the stuff. <laughs> I have to like manually load and unload the pack piece. I guess it would make sense if I didn't have backpacks on everyone, but I already have a thieves backpack for everyone, basically. So yeah, but the advantage is you're not having all that weight on the other characters slowing them down. Right, but the pack mule's the slowest, so I'm slowing down the slowest, which is worse. Uh, he's not getting slowed down. Oh well, I guess that's good. Yeah, if you look at the the if you mouse over the backpack he's wearing, it has massive weight reduction. So, uh, um, ninety percent. He's still getting encumbered though by it. He's, yeah, to some extent, but he's also going to get stronger as he gets older. He's got right. a twenty-one strength uh, or weight encumbrance allowability right now. And he's not even half there yet with all the stuff he put on anything him. Anything else here I need? I, don't see I might anything. buy the hemp. The hemp. Eventually, you're going to want to use that for fabrics what and maybe this? even. Oh, this? Yeah. Oh, Eventually, that's... you might want to use that to make fabrics for, um, for clothing. You can use cotton or you can use hemp, and they grow differently in different zones. Right. Okay, well, we got kind of what we came for. One last place I want to check. That's the weapons here. Probably not going to buy a weapon because they're always so expensive. Ooh, what the heck is that? Heavy weapon class. Falling sun. Ooh, it's a nice heavy weapon. Extra damage against beak things, gorillas, and leviathans. Way too expensive. You know what's crazy? Hmm. We had like 29,000 when we walked into town here, and we have like 2,000 now. I don't know how. <laughs> I guess it's all the books. Spending spree. We bought med packs. Books. That's it, really. Oh, I guess we bought these two. This was like 10,000 for these two pieces of armor. Yeah, the armor was expensive. Right. Oh, and there you have more books, too. Yeah. I bought like 30-something books. A couple maps. A 
we'll use those right away. Now, one of them was the swamps. Swamp Village, Swamp Village, and and Shark. I don't remember what the other one was for. Doesn't seem to be showing anything specific. I said it was Probably new though. To... Yeah, it was probably something weird. Oh well. I should have not opened both of them. I should have opened one, looked at the map, and then opened the other and looked at the map because then it would have highlighted the first one as green as well. Mm -hmm. uh, oh well. I think we are heading back to the hub now. We can drop off this stuff. Oh, you can just keep it on there too. We need to cook, actually. We're going to cook right here. Well, actually, we'll go. We'll run back and then we'll cook. I know there's people probably starving already, but. Yeah. I want to get back and then cook there so that I can spend. Um, while people are sitting around cooking, I can do shopping and stuff in the area. Mm -hmm. Instead of just waiting and doing nothing out here for a while. I like that it's a bit of a straight shot between these two settlements. You can actually see both of them. From in between. Which is kind of cool. Just running along. Yeah, see, this is kind of annoying. And then everyone runs out for God knows what reason. He does have that light, which is going to be nice. Maybe. I think those people are running out to go to the beds in the Shinobi Thieves Guild. Probably. I don't want them to do that right now, though. Alright. Talk to Big Toe. Whatever, guys, go sleep if that's what you have to do right now. Can I build inside? Come back. Yeah, they were sleeping in beds. What is happening? They were attacking my poor little creature. I need to make sure everyone has something equipped. So, there we go. Flan has something. Um, we don't want these helmets on our archers. stuff on now. Hey, 
a few of these armored rags. I'm going to sell some of them. And some helmets. Make sure to set this house to public while we're at it. Um, and we'll sell a couple crossbows. That looks pretty good. Yeah, it should do good. everyone has something on. Very nice. Big toe is empty. That's what we like to see. Now hopefully we can start getting some ambient cash. I want to check the trader here. Is that him? Nope. Are you? Hmm. It's the guy with the backpack. There he is. Ooh. This is what I like to see. Bunch of... We do want another one of these. Can't afford it though. That's nice too. Black and chain still reduces stealth effect. Probably not as much as the other options, but too bad we don't have the money for that. Well, do we have money for? I kind of like to get these these large backpacks, honestly. I know they reduce combat effects, but they're just so much more useful than the small backpacks. Yeah, and losing two, two combat effect is not that bad. No, it's, it's really not. They are kind of expensive. Yeah, but a half price here than anywhere else. Yep, yeah, it's much better here than anywhere else. I guess I'll get one, because you don't really come across too many of them. So... And we, we're going to keep this backpack because eventually we'll get another person, so it's better than nothing. I don't know why I took my weapon off. That was kind of weird. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't sure about that one. <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, okay, backpack in a backpack. Anyone need major peeling? I think we're, we're doing pretty good. We're doing pretty good. We just need food. Let's finish cooking that food. I wonder if those uh, guys went and stole my food. Still running off and sleeping. Oh, this is actually pretty convenient. I thought it was going to be a little bit more annoying, but I can switch between them really easily. We're going to make another.
speed cooking. There we go. Is open, it's unlocked. I feel like I should lock these chests. Do I have a locked version of a chest I can make? No, but I don't think anyone accesses your chests. Unless they're like raiding or something. Yeah. Alright. They wouldn't raid inside of town. Hopefully. We need to head up um, the towers again. See if we can get anything done. See if we can lure out the Dust King. And if we can't do that, we'll head over the ninjas and try and lure them out slowly. There's a rebel... Oh, I keep seeing the rebel base and I keep thinking it's like some sort of camp that I can fight. It's just that bar. I'm the only one running this way. Why? It's just that desire to destroy the rebel scum. Right. I have no idea where these people think they're going. They're all going different directions. They'll figure it out eventually. Do we go through do we go through stats at the beginning of this? I feel like I missed doing that. Um I don't recall. Yeah, I don't think we did. I think I got distracted talking about inventory. Well Yeah. We can go through stats right now. Well, people are getting attacked by something. What are you getting attacked by, people? Oh. Derby bandits? Yep. Oh, more. Lovely. This is actually a pretty good fight. Yeah, everyone's getting a lot of training because there's lots of them. We chase him down. Oh, look, there's even more. Wow. And these are dust bandits fighting hungry bandits. And you're just like, I want to join in. Yep, I'm like, I'll fight you all. Okay. Wowzers. Right. And uh, there's more people to fight? Heck. <laughs> Placeholder 2 wakes up saying, did I miss it all? <laughs> you missed some of it, that's for sure. Now, this is where it may be handy to, like, bring one character and the bull and just kind of, like, swap over to the bull when you're looting. Okay, we'll do that. I don't think it's going to be any it's more efficient. It's not a bull, I guess. Uh, where is the bull? Where is the pack animal? I have no idea. So we'll just have, well, like I can't loot with the bull, right? So right. I'll put the bull right here. I could have the bull follow somebody, I suppose. Have the bull yeah. follow Ruka and then loot with Ruka. 
and then switch to the bowl. But then I'm going to have to offload all of this because the bull can't, like, walk into shops. No, but you can sell. He'll be close enough to sell to a shop. Mm -hmm. They make allowances for the uh, pack bulls not being able to go into places. See, now the pack bulls... What? You moved him away. Right, but he's supposed to be following... You didn't, you didn't assign it as a job. All right. I gotta reselect Ruka. See, like, I could just loot now, but I gotta switch. And then he's out of range, so I need to wait. And now he's stopped there. And now I have to switch to Ruka. All right, all right. Loot, yeah, and I gotta switch fine. back to Big Toe. And then he's still out of range. Because he doesn't follow close enough. That's fine. He can't Tr follow. Trust me, you'll, you'll thank me when you want to carry a lot of heavy stuff. Okay. I'm gonna wait till I actually want to use it. And then I will use it. He's just gonna level up for now. Got caught stealing. Really, dude? Whoa. He's doing a, uh, a perfect dive. Look at that. Perfect form. Legs are straight. Perfect spin. His arms are kind of flailing, but not bad. And uh, he also can levitate because he's stuck there. What is happening? Well, oh, he fell to the ground. Where is he? Oh, I think he just landed on his feet and ran away like a champ. Good old physics. Physics in Kenji is just a suggestion. Yeah. Just take it under advisement and continue flying. I don't see proper bandits here. Got a few injuries. We'll see if this tower has calmed down now. Yeah, see if they're still on high alert, watching their walls. Hmm. Does look like they're still on their their guns and everything. Yeah. The big guy is still right here. I might wait till nighttime and see what I can get done. Master Tyron, please don't walk straight by in front of them. Thank you. It would figure that he'd just get one shot. Yeah, it's a little bit dangerous during the day. There's a lot of guy uh, guys on uh, things, and you don't really have... I suppose you have 71 in Harpoon Resistance on your helmet, but don't have much elsewhere. Just kind of scary. True.
just gonna wait until nighttime. We'll attack them on day 69, and it'll hopefully go well. We'll get good karma for that. Yeah, hopefully it'll be nice. Mm. Should have uh, brought some beds, maybe. Yeah. on the ground. Oh, here's a guy. If nothing else, we can basically kill bandits that are coming and going. And that should reduce their numbers a little bit. This is a pretty good blade. That was a dust boss. No warrant for him. Reducing their numbers out here, I guess. All right, nighttime, ban. I'm gonna have you offload into somebody else's backpack. Now you can sneak. It looks like they aren't actually manning the walls at night here. And the dust boss guy is still outside. I'm gonna see if I can pick the door. Oh no, the door's still open from when we picked it last time. I might try and just stealth KO the dust boss. What do you think? Uh, a zero, you can try. There's a 0% chance. Oh, uh, then maybe you can't try. Ah, you could bad. try to knock out the guys that are on the guns, maybe. There's no one on the guns at oh. night. Yeah. Well, then maybe you just rush in. Yeah, last time there were just like a million guys just sitting inside. Mm -hmm. But again, they're mostly dust bandits. Right, but the dust boss, like, almost one-shot somebody. Yeah, you'd have to get um, probably like Rain the Giant tanking him. You did get some gear upgrades. Well, we'll let this guy go inside, and then I'll see if I can just taunt the big guy out. Yeah. And we'll fight him um, right at the entrance. I know everyone's not really sneaky, but... If we can just put everyone right here. And fight the guy just long enough to down him. That might not be bad. I don't really want to fight where they can shoot me with a bunch of things, but I do want to make sure that I aggro him enough. Oh, see immediately. Immediately, um, you are seen by this guy. He shouldn't be able to shoot you right here, right? I don't know how good the game is about that. Can't 
Can't really stealth KO him either. Hmm. You try to run up there and fight him. Oh my lord. Or you can just get them all attacking. Right, I mean, I didn't mean to, but... As soon as they, uh... We actually have the big guy outside right now. You can maybe run up and lock their gate. <laughs> yeah, but they can just open it, because they yeah. own it. Dude, Big Toe is freaking got wrecked. I want to make sure to aggro. Ah, the boss just runs. He's running to a turret, too. I really don't want to fight under turrets. I'll fight him out here. Okay. Yeah, those turrets are going to do some numbers on you, though. I don't think that... So there's nobody. Oh, there are people on those two turrets. Yeah. Shoot. Yeah, and keep they running. They can shoot you from there. Well, they shouldn't be able to shoot me out here, right? Uh, here you shouldn't be getting shot. Yeah. We can take out a few of them. That was actually pretty quick. Make sure to disarm them. Was it just the three of them that we got lured out? Looks like it. No, there's another one that's not bleeding. It'll stand up soon. Oh, here he is. Blending in with the dirt. Well, take the weapon off, ban. I already threw it on the ground. Why oh, is did you? Big right. Toe getting attacked again? The shooting him? I don't think so. Well, he's got a stupid light on. So I now I need to put him in a freaking different squad because <laughs> it makes it impossible for us to be sneaky. Okay. Ban scouting mission again. For some reason it says Big Toe's being attacked still. Oh, is this uh, an archer? Put him on, um... Stealth KO time. Donk. I guess this was an archer and it was attacking our our critter. Must have been what was happening. Well, you got some assassination training. Yeah. Our big toe is still being attacked. By Just what? set him to passive so he's not like targeted. Right, but it's like blinking. Freaking weird. See, he's still getting attacked. Yeah, I don't know. Is there a reason for this, you stupid animal? Go over here. That's gotta be a bug. I haven't seen that. Strange, strange. This is the dust boss guy, or a dust boss. There's only one guy on a turret. Can I... Stealth KO him? 
I know I'm gonna get you killed, man. Oh, failed. Run. Assassin. Who in the world is coming from the other side right now? Hmm. Alright, I think this is far enough to fight. Did the Dust King come out? Is that... No. No, it's just a, a regular Dust Boss. Well, you are slowly whittling them down, at least. Right? Yeah, it's working out. I mean, I'm fine fighting a bunch of them if none of them have gear. They keep getting up and, like, going back in, but they're all naked, so... I'm not particularly worried about fighting a guy with no weapon. Or a bunch of guys with no weapons. Mm -hmm. Anyone on the turrets? Doesn't look like it. Let's see if we can lure out a few more. Okay, dust boss is here. I don't see... I think we'll fight him until people show up on the turrets. No one's on the turrets. Okay, we really have to focus on this boss guy, though. Hey, we got him down. Loot and scoot. Alright, what we got? A very nice ringed saber. That'll be an upgrade for me. And some decent stuff. And I'm immediately going to pick him up. Uh, Fumin, why did you not pick him up? our bounty right there guys stop going back inside oh my gosh is there anybody else I don't know well we kind of mission accomplished right there mm -hmm. we got our bounty and it really wasn't bad we only got one person down in the process be sure to heal him up too so he doesn't die otherwise he's worth half Ah, uh, good point. I will do that. Um, I'm gonna just grab this saber though. Look at this thing. Dust King cutting damage 1.48 and then 0.28 for blunt damage. Pretty good. Very good. Alright. And we've got some pants for Ruka. Ruka's our other big tanky Shuck. So they're gonna get that. We got some dark leather shirt. That's standard grade. Somebody could use that, I'm sure. Guess I'll take it, and then Heron can have the full leather shirt. Tyron can have that. Pretty good deal. I like it. Everyone heal up. And I guess I can have this person follow Ruka. I think we take this back to the um, hub? Well, where's the uh, bounty on the guy? Yeah, let's check that. Let's also heal him. I almost forgot to do that. Uh... Fumin. No, Molly. Is he dead already? Uh, they might have healed him Oh, already. no, he's healed already. Yeah, if you're carrying someone, you heal them. Yeah. I think automatically. Yeah, I think so. Sweet. Now, so where's he walking? Probably all three of the nations, I bet. Dust King is wanted in United Cities, Holy Nation, and Shek Kingdom. Yep. Where's the easiest place to walk to? 
Um. Maybe we go to stack because we have to walk through this valley to get out. So who's currently carrying them? That's the real question, because if it's a human. Yeah, good. I did make sure to pick them up with a human this time. We'll take them to the Holy Nation. Yeah, I think stack was where you dropped off the last one. Right. We'll do that. Um, let's not walk in front of it, though. Carrying their boss. Uh, be kind of silly. It's gonna take us a while. I know you're tempted by that food. Yeah, how much food do we have? I don't think I'm gonna do it, but... I am tempted. We did eat all of our food already somehow. And that is a lot of food. We have, like a lot of, meat. we have a lot of injured people, though. And this is three of the big guys. The big guys really pummeled us last time. Mm -hmm. I think we'll pass on it. If we see goats, we'll fight goats. If we see dogs, we'll fight the dogs. I think these are not as dangerous as goats, because they do blunt damage. Right. But goats we can kill so fast, I think, now, that it's not an issue. Damn it. Hooligans everywhere I turn. Excellent. Off to see the wizard. Wait, why are we going that way, guys? We're supposed to be going this way. Hello? Hello? Um, okay. Is it this valley that I have to walk up? I guess so. Ah, it is. It's kind of annoying. One bounty and one good weapon. Big Toe, where are you going? Don't want to walk by the holy mines, per se. Look at all this iron. So much iron. What the heck? That's why there's mines there. Right. But then it says there's no iron on the map. Yeah, it's I think that weird. that uh, just a prospecting only takes into account the ones you can actually access. Right. Must. Because while there is a lot of iron there, it's not ones that you can actually use as like a uh, as a node. Go to the hub, except for with these people. These people will go there. Wait. Uh, F. Now you got a problem. F. Okay. Don't have the guy who's oh the guy that's carrying it dropped it, didn't he? He's running. Our bounty's yeah. running. Um Shoot. Ban, do you want to fight the bounty? Yeah, send him. He's probably fast enough. Let's send three people after the bounty. Everyone else, fight these stupid dogs. Oh, he's getting away so fast. I think he'll catch him. And then if you catch yeah, him, I, I should be able to catch up as well. I don't know if we'll be able to beat him. Maybe? Sure. 
Maybe. The thing is, these guys are getting wrecked by dogs because everyone else is somewhere else. Because you split the party. Well, because there were dogs that we just walked through. <laughs> yeah. Whatever. Ban, get him. Oh, I think you got him. You got him cornered. Oh, knocked him out. Nice. Why is my arm not getting healed up? These guys are all downed over here. I was going to say, where are the numbers? Why am I seeing no numbers? Well, this solves our food problem too, I guess. There should be more dogs around here. Where are all of them? There we go. Don't see any more. Well, looks like we got everyone on our shoulders that we need to. Band. here. Taking all three of us just in case the guy like somehow gets loose again. But I don't want to take the uh, the rest of the party. We can't get too close to Holy Nation territory with the rest of them. Mm -hmm. All right. Easy money, 35,000 coming right up. The dogs were the most annoying thing we fought there. But they're also the most delicious thing we fought, so I'll take it. Blessings. Yeah, they need to... brother. Oh, hey, he said something about the Dust King. He's like, I see you got the Dust King or something like that. Hmm. I guess we wait here overnight.
plus eight defense, plus four indoors. I might get some of these for my healers so that if they're getting attacked up close, they can defend themselves better. This is actually a nice ringed saber as well. Can't buy them both. The ring saber is actually better. 0 0.7, 0 0.1. Yeah, it is. Take it. is a blunt blunt there we go Anything else worth buying here? I don't think so. Actually, I have quite a few of these decent horse choppers now. Sorry about that. I had to take my headset off. That's fine. I'm just playing inventory manager for the moment while we wait for it to be daytime because the guy's not sitting in his throne at night, apparently.
thought Ruka had the dried meat. Somebody had it. Maybe you ate it all already. Yeah, I guess so. Everyone was really hungry, so not entirely surprising. Threw some stuff in here. I actually don't know if this will actually sell anything. In this town, it might not. I'm not sure. Well, whatever. It's doubling its storage right now. Yeah. Do we have anything else of standard value? We're gonna have to just sell some of this stuff. Why not? Back up to 14,000. We still haven't sold the guy. Pretty good. I, I think we're going to hold off on buying more books and stuff until we have our armor situation sorted the way we want it to be. Yeah, this pack beast is just starving. What does the pack beast eat? Eat? Raw meat? Mmm. Sure. Raw meat. Um. Gosh. I don't know what pack beast eats at all. I mean, if you put food in the backpack that it has, it'll probably eat it. We'll try. Gotta find my food though first. I think everyone ate all the food. Yeah? You don't have any food. Whatever. Oh, here's food. Who is this person? Ninja guard? <laughs> One of the guards you looted before. They survived. <laughs> I guess. Oh, I did eat the raw meat. Okay, well, now we know. Just waiting for it to be daytime. We caught the bandit boss on day 69. I feel like that was appropriate. Yeah. We did get some good luck on that day. Nice. Oh, hey, Flynn. Hey, what's up? Snuck in here. <laughs> Dude, the plastic surgeon is a a hiver. I didn't realize that before. So, Flan, you have a legendary weapon now. Oh, let's go. One of a kind blade. The only one we have. It's a uh, ninja blade. My two ninja blade. My toe. Whatever it's called. Me too. Mewtwo. Me too. Mewtwo. Yeah. Mewtwo. A Mewtwo. Mewtwo. Oh, right. now. You are 31 in katanas with 30s in your attack and defense as well. So pretty darn good. Your athletics is getting way up there. It's up in the 70s. Assassination is 13. Stealth is 
39. Not bad. Mm-hmm. We're about good, to sell a good dust dexterity boss. Dexterity and toughness, too. Our dust boss we just caught. Actually, the dust king we just caught out of his tower. So. Yeah, I was watching that. Nice. I was nice. here for a while. Yeah, I didn't realize when you actually came in. Um. I was gonna do something with this. I was gonna buy something. These are pretty good blades too. Holy cow! Probably that leather vest. Mark two. Yeah, the dark leather vest. That's one of the things I was gonna buy for sure. Dark leather shirt. Dark leather shirt. Give that to Heron, and then someone else can wear that. Chain? Nah. We will replace another one of these little backpacks with a big one, though. I'm actually getting, like, a, a chain mail or something. Oh, you already have chain mail for Rain the Giant, don't you? Yep, and, um, and for Ruka, they both have full chain mail. That's at least standard ones, high grade. Mm -hmm. So that's pretty good. It's a standard armor hood, but we have at least that on everybody already. Let's check. We don't really need better ninja blades, I don't think. 0 0.72, 0 0.99. That is better, but it's just not worth it, I don't think. Yeah, it's fifty percent off buying it anywhere else. Right, it is cheaper here, but uh, I'm not worried. These guys already have extremely good blades mm -hmm. compared to what a lot of other people are using. Yeah, theirs is pretty darn good. Um, these pants. Is there anyone wearing? Hmm. Trash, no. These are standard. I think these are better. These leather pants. I think they're better than the samurai pants. They cover a little bit less. Little they bit have way resistance. higher resistance. 28, 26, 50 compared to 11, 17, 50. Yeah. yeah pretty cheap. Flan, you want an upgrade? Sure. Oh, Flan's not here. Shoot. Eh, we could buy it anyway, right? Buy it and give it to you when you get back. Oh, actually, this was a high grade. I don't think the standard grade is actually that much better. Nah. If we see another high grade one, we'll get it. armor is slowly trickling down to the point where everyone has stuff. We're just missing shirts now. Pretty much. Yeah, you're getting there. Yep, yep. I think Molly needs more ammo. Molly's almost out of ammo. I thought you had plenty of that type of ammo. It's stored right now. She did have like five stacks on her, but we fought a lot. Look at that. Perfect. Except for us, we're starving. Is the guy back to his throne yet? Come on, dude. Go sit in your throne. I have people to turn in. Where is he? Is he in bed or something? I don't know. 
I mean, if there's an open cage, you could just dump it in there, I there, guess. There is not, unfortunately. What about upstairs? And I really don't want to risk... No. I want to risk uh, not getting paid for it. Though, mm. we already talked to him once and told him we need to get paid. I wonder if he'll... Uh, how he'll feel about us saying that again. Hey, you can bring him somewhere else. might just fight us too that's the weird thing what if I sit in the chair <laughs> uh, I don't think they'd go for that oh here he is high inquisitor Seta did you talk to him last time I hope you didn't I hope it was somebody else I think it was me god here goes nothing um, sure but we need to discuss payment 35,000, let's go. There we go. I was a little worried that it wasn't going to let us do the same thing again, but... <laughs> eh, what do we want to buy here? We should check the clothing shop, see if they have undershirts. I know they're more expensive here, but... It's either that or wait for forever. For the other place to refresh a bunch. And we can get rid of the rest of the junk we're carrying. That one's actually good. All right. Oh, well, we need to pick up got some full chain mail. We need to pick up hats too. Oh yeah, they do. Super expensive. Just looking for undershirts right now for people. We'll get... Was, was that a high grade chain mail? No, standard. Oh. No, not the rusty one, the, the other ones. Rusty chain mail? You mean the rusty chain shirts? Oh, the no, shiny like chain mail? The shiny chain mail. The non-rusty chain mail? I, yeah, that no, is a high shiny. grade, but it costs 17000 Oof. Which is a bit much for our budget right now. We don't even have everyone in a shirt. True. Uh, I don't really like the vests because they just don't cover any of the arms. At least these cover some of the arm. I guess they are half price. We'll hold off on it though. See if we can buy some hats while we're here. We need two more of those archer hats. Okay, it's just boots and nonsense here. Drifter boots. Where's the hat shop? Is this the hat shop? I think so, it's got a hat, a samurai hat. None of the things we want, though. So yeah, you might have to go to a different town to get those kind of hats you want. What is... Oh, this is the Zeruda. Yeah, we might. The tin can, I think, is good. Because I think it's 100% coverage. Minus 20 perception. It is 100% yeah. coverage. And it, has a, it has tons of armor. But it reduces yeah. dodge, reduces attack. Which is okay, I guess. They're yeah, really if, you're, if you're using someone as a tank, it's really good for tanking. Right. Maybe I can get two of those for Ruka and Rain the Giant. I don't actually know if they're better than what we're wearing, though. Because we're wearing high level. 27, 48, 65. 81. 27, 48, 65, 81. I mean, it's more harpoon resistance and a little bit more cut resistance efficiency. Mm. Nah. I'm not impressed. We have high grades on both of these people. Yeah, no need to replace them just yet then. Right. Then maybe if those were high grade buckets. It'd yeah, be then I then I'd do it. Yeah. But 
They're not. Is there any other place that might be selling stuff that we need? Probably not in this town, to be honest. Some bars. I guess we'll check this travel shop. Maybe they have something. Oh, that's right. This guy never has anything I need. I mean, he has building materials and whatnot, which is cool, but not any clothing. Sometimes the bars have that kind of stuff, right? Mm, the bars don't usually have clothing. Not here. Everyone gets to eat some meat, though. Because we were starving. Uh, there's this mechanic shop. Advanced harpoonery, advanced outpost, random furniture. What? I think these are just decorative. Yeah. Yeah, those are. It's this building. Coordination, L House, Armory. Oh, shoot. Didn't mean to do that, guys. Go back to doing what you were doing. Dang it. Well, most of them were mostly healed. So I don't feel bad about not putting them back in beds. We're going to have to start looking for food again, though. Find some goats. All right, let's get out of here. Regroup, fight some stuff. Get food. A fish. Some food cubes. Expensive. Go on. Yep. You need to go to a different you town. You didn't actually buy the Gohan. <laughs> I didn't? I'm sure no, I did. But the vegetable bowl again. Oh my gosh. What does it look like? Why do I always do this? Looks like rice with bacon on it. Yeah, I keep buying the vegetable bowl. It's just what I'm used to seeing. Oh, does um, Tyron need bolts? Uh, Tyron... Oh, Tyron does. I see you picked up a jit. A what? Jit. Oh, yeah. A melee weapon for Tyron. Yeah, yeah I want both of my range people to have these. Well, at least... Yeah. Actually, I should switch this on to Molly, so that... Because Molly's our healer, and this will keep her up longer if she gets in melee. Yes, for sure. Now she's one of our healers. Yeah, but I want to get another one of them, too, eventually. Speaking of which, Molly needs ammo. Just buy some. I think we go to the uh, tower with... Um, what are they called? Ninjas this time? Because I don't know if the Dusk King... Maybe we finish clearing the Dusk King tower. Stay focused on one thing, and then next time we can go to the ninjas. Everyone run at the same speed, please. 
Yeah, because I think the ninja place still had a uh, bounty. There was one guy yeah, with a bounty still. There was still a, a major player there. And I'm guessing the Dust King was the only big one at this. There were a bunch of dust bosses. Mm -hmm. Look. Combat experience. Can't click on them for some reason. That's okay. That one guy was decent. There's gotta be a reason that everyone's running different directions again. Hate it when that happens. Gotta keep an eye out for goats and Different things like that. Oh, here we go. I think we kind of have to fight them just because we need food so bad. We have people starving. It's, it's worth it, yeah. I'm a big fan of this because they hit with ridiculous AoE. Like, when he attacks forwards, he hits literally everybody. Yep. Super dumb. But also, you should be targeting attacking all because they're focusing. I hit attack all. There's just only four things to attack. Alright, we're gonna cook right here. And now that I know you can just make a bunch of campfires and do it all really fast. I'm just going to do that. Who's here now? Dust bandits. Okay. We're trying to... Get rid of all the dust bandits, so. Get this crawler. Oh my gosh, there's more. Is there like a camp here? What is going on? Who is this? Wandering assassin. Okay. Get him. Uh, that was good. We already have looting. Is there a way to... Oh, it says forging animals. I wish I could auto-loot. Yeah, no, there's no auto-loot function. But also, eventually, you're not going to want to leave this crap anyway. I know. It's getting close to that point, honestly, where it's, like, just really annoying to do. Mm -hmm. Um. I'm um, what? Uh. <laughs> you know what? I'm just going to let it happen because you didn't want them anyway. Where's this idiot? Molly's, Molly's fixing it. Oh. Well, he's not fixing it. Where in the world is this? This is why it's a problem. This thing has been nothing but problems since we got it banned. I'm telling Just leave you, it, then. it was not a good idea. Uh, I've used them before. Like, maybe it's good when you only have a couple people. But once you have enough people to pack mule on your own back, just, it's just a nuisance. Yeah, sure. I mean, different play styles. I prefer to have those rather than 
packing everything on 20 different characters I gotta sw switch between. It's really easy to switch characters, though. Yeah, it's hard fine. to switch to the pack meal. It's just so much more time consuming. Sure. Uh... Why are they... Why were they, like, killing Molly? Uh, what the hell? Super weird. Whatever. Can I put Molly on its back? Probably not. Oof. Yeah, Molly's gonna be out for a while there. Yeah. My pets are getting eaten. That's what do they deserve, though. My pets are a nuisance, honestly. <sighs> I don't know. Never been a fan of them in this game. Food. Everyone have food. mass cooking here. There we go. Really? Only does one at a time. All right. I see people to loot. Nope, those aren't people to loot. There should be more of them somewhere. Quite, quite a few of them. To the Dust King's Tower. Back on track. Or Big Toe. We'll leave Big Toe in our town and we'll use him to do trading eventually. Well, they are dust bandits. I guess we're gonna fight them. Yeah, we're really wrecking dust bandits now. We did have somebody go down that time. None of these guys seem to have bounties, unfortunately. Yeah, I don't know what that's all about. Usually the dust bosses have a bounty. They're just not cool enough. I think I bet it's the... Uh, oh, this guy does. Hey, let's go. All I have to do is say something about it, and then the game proves me wrong every single time. <laughs> well, then you might as well say, ah, oh, there couldn't be a second one, though. Yeah, there couldn't possibly be another Dust King. 
right? Or did somebody already take up that title? Oh, Molly's unconscious. I'm like, why isn't Molly looting? She can't. And we got another person unconscious already. Oh, that was a dust boss. Next to the guy that was, uh... Yeah, I checked him. He doesn't have a bounty. Yeah. Oh. I was assuming that the... The dust bosses that don't have bounties were probably ones that were specific to this outpost. Because there were like eight or nine of them here. I'm wondering if it was just like to level up the people that are in this region. They just made a, like a handful of them dust bosses that are always patrolling. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, we're not sneaky at all with this lantern goat behind us. I really wonder how many people are actually still here. Well, only one way to find out. I mean, this dust ban is just on the... Wait a second. There's a new dust king. Oh. Well then, proved you wrong. What the? You heck? did say that, didn't you? I should say that every time. Look, there's another thirty-five thousand sitting here waiting to get taken in. I guess if you leave We're more dust in... bosses there, eventually they level up to a dust king. Huh? Right. They must just take over. I thought we were actually more beat Are up than clean? we are. Molly's having a bad day. Heron's gonna have a bad day. Maybe we just drop Molly over here. Ruka, put down. And who else is getting carried? Oh, Molly's up. Wow. You should probably lay back down, Molly. We're gonna fight right now. And, uh... I don't really want you fighting in that condition. You know what I could do? I could set Big Toe to bodyguard Molly. Yeah. Big Toe's dying of starvation, though. Will Big Toe eat... cooked meat? Or was it, like, only... Oh, he ate the dried meat. Okay. All right, we're gonna move a couple people. Nah, we're not gonna do it. We're just gonna grab everyone. See if we can lure out the bus dust boss again. Ben, you're like too sneaky. They just don't see you. All right, everyone back off. Everyone back all the way off. All right, we're out of turret range. Is the dust boss actually here, or did he run back inside? Looks like he ran back inside. Wait. Oh, placeholder's carrying this bounty. I guess he's fighting with the bounty on his shoulder. So be it. Looks like the dust king turned around and ran back in. Oh, you know what I bet happened? I bet a different bandit group took over and beat up the bandits that were here or something. Because, like, there's a ton of bandits just, like, dying on the ground. Alright, I don't know where the Dust King is, but... Oh, here he is. I did hit attack all. Ah, uh, I don't want to put this guy down, but I think I'm going to put him down. I don't want... Will it inhibit my attacking if I leave him? Eh, should be fine. We are going to do that, though, this time. A little bit worried. Oof. He's gonna get downed. Ban! Oh, yeah, you were not helpful. 
placeholders somehow surviving this? There goes that guy. That was our bounty running off. Uh, whatever, he can go become Dust King next time. Uh, does this mean we're going to get another really good saber? I guess so. Oh, that was a good shot. There we go. Who is going to pick this guy up? Something special is down. All right, we got our bounty. That's the most important thing here. Got a lot of people down still though. All right, we're only looting standard gear for a little bit. Of course, then every piece of gear I see is standard. We're only looting high gear for a bit. Maybe I'll get all high gear now, right? We're gonna take their weapons though. Ah, screw it. I just don't want them getting back up and then being able to fight us. A lot of people downed already. I wonder what they have for defenses in here. Another dust boss, dust boss, dust bandit. Dust boss, but he's not a threat. Half of our people are down or carrying somebody. Yeah, let's take a break. But I mean, we gotta run back to town with everyone here. Nothing else we made. 70,000 today, catching dust bosses. Let's not run into dogs like we did last time. Coats would be okay though. Wait, guys, it's a dog. Oh my lord. Maybe I should just play this game silently. <laughs> Literally, I'm cursed today. Uh, you could always put some uh, some meat on the uh, some raw meat on the camel or the. Whatever that thing is. There we go. Give him something to munch on. Hmm. I like it that they don't uh, discriminate. They don't require only raw meat or only cooked mm -hmm. meat. They just eat whatever yeah. you put on them. Yeah, exactly. And they might... I don't know if they eat the nasty meat from the raptors. I don't remember. Hmm. Always... I think they might. Oh my gosh. I don't have time for this, guys. 
We're actually going to have a hard time because everyone's carrying somebody. Uh, yeah, make sure that uh, your bounty doesn't run off. Where? Well, we didn't put the bounty down, did we? Unless the person got knocked out. I think the person got knocked out. Gosh, dang it. Where is our bounty? Oh, no, he's... The unconscious? No, he's right here. No, that's a placeholder. Yeah, no, but the, the guy is right here. The Dust King. This no, is the Dust King. That's not the Dust King. Oh, who is it? Wait, where is the. <laughs> he was being carried by something special, and something special got knocked out. So he's probably running away. Uh, I actually didn't loot him either yet, I don't think. Wow. You let him run off with all his gear. Where the F is he? I need to zoom out and see where things move. I feel like he should be right here. He's heading back towards his tower. Maybe. Unless he's unconscious. Right. Bandit leader. We were chasing something this way. I don't know what. I'll unpause for half a second to see if I see something moving over here. He would be on the road going this way, wouldn't he? I don't see him. Shoot. Yeah, I was going to loot him right away, but then I wanted to make sure to heal everyone, and then I picked everyone up, and... That's placeholder, Heron, Molly, Flan. It's so hard to tell with everyone carrying somebody. Mm hmm. Well, I know for a fact he picked him up with something special, and uh, something special's out, so. He got away, but where? He went back towards his tower. Mother of Pearls. How many people do we have that are still up? Not enough. I don't think there's much I can do about it right now, unfortunately. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't realize it soon enough. It must have happened early in the fight. We have another person down, and I don't even know if we... Fumin's not carrying anyone. Gosh dang it. Stupid bandits. Ruining my day. Yeah, that's rough, buddy. Should we go back and try and get him? I don't think, like, I'm sure he's running at a million miles an hour, and he's just running back he's to the He's probably tower. already there. <laughs> yeah, like, <sighs> freaking annoying. Quite annoying. There goes our 35,000. I gotta keep track of him better. And also, I, I didn't loot him. I should have looted him immediately like I did last time. Yeah. What can you do? Lessons learned. We still got a bunch of stuff that time, though. It's a chunk for the most part, but... <sighs> okay. But you can't put them in shackles or anything? If I had shackles, I could, but I don't have shackles. Should probably get a pair if I'm gonna keep hunting bounties. If I see a pair, I'll buy it. Everywhere we go. This is why we need to wipe out the bandits. It's just non-stop. This poor ninja. Dude, they're leveling up. They're probably gonna win. I'm gonna help them. This ninja. 
with no closes still here. Where's the bartender? Hello? Is the bartender out here? I hope the bartender didn't get killed or knocked out. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. You uh, looked you like a bandit, you idiots. Ninja. Well, it looked exactly like the bandits from the zoomed out position. I don't want to fight the ninjas. I really don't want to fight this one, whatever this one is. I'm a trillion stats. But I don't think I can outrun them now. Can I just, like, make peace? Seriously annoying. Are they gonna make me fight this because I misclicked? Gosh dang it, whatever. Not happy about this game. Now I'm gonna loot them because this is what you get. The ninjas are hostile now. Is that what it said? Yeah, trade oh, ninjas boy. are hostile towards you. Well, guess you can't trade in this town anymore. Minus 33. Bar is owned by the Trade Ninjas. Wow. Yeah. One misclick, and this is what happens. Well. We're taking your junk. If you're going to be hostile towards us. We're going to take your junk. Just like we did with the other person, apparently. We'll heal you, though. Because maybe that will make you less hostile with us. I don't know. It actually is. That actually made me significantly less hostile with them. Hmm. How's that negative 30-something? They aren't just outright attacking me right now, so... Whatever. Can't seem to... It's just a guard. I have no idea what happened to their, uh, their traitor anyway. Is that their traitor that was on the floor? No, that was a bandit. Uh, I don't know, it's possible the traitor got killed at some point. That is kind of sad. Home sweet home. Not feeling like home anymore. At least we have this place. Covered in... animals, for some reason. <laughs> um, who is attacking me? Seriously, where do these buffoons come from? Shifty, get up. Okay, what's attacking me now? I actually have no idea. They were just all running off somewhere. Okay. I think I need any of this. Uh, these swords are good. We'll keep those.
I don't think there's any upgrades here, is there? Some more food, maybe? Well, we can still camp out. We're gonna ignore that guy. We can still camp out in the ninja tower, right? Those are the shinobi thieves. They shouldn't care. Really do need to heal up, so. Well, this really heavy armor does make a huge difference. The people that are wearing it are totally fine after all that fighting. Take us a while to heal up. See if we can find the uh, bartender. Oh, here's the barman, actually, right here. They just, you know, recovery coma. Oh, those are uh, slave traders. Come to subjugate the bandits. Good, take them away. Are they going to take the barkeep? Uh, I hope not. They haven't yet. Maybe they have some sort of agreement. Quite a few of those. I guess we don't need to keep those anymore. Can I train Big Toe on the dummies? No. <laughs> With my luck, Big Toe will like grow up while he's inside and won't be able to walk out through the door. Hey, sorry, I had my headset off again. I miss anything interesting? Nope. Not really. Just healing everyone up. Yeah. They had a rough day. We need to find better hats for our people here. And we <laughs> still need to buy a bunch of undershirts for people. 
Having a bit of trouble doing that though, because the barman is currently in a coma over here. Yeah. You know, this might be a good opportunity actually to uh, to try to bring everything through to that village that's in the middle of the mist. To the middle of the, the fog. mist. Hmm. I see goats. I see food. <laughs> Everyone just got done healing, but I see food, guys. You can't resist the goats. We're basically out of food right now, so... Yeah. This is our... one of our number one food sources. The goats. Rook is cooking. And everyone else can trade. Assuming there's anything we can actually sell to this person. Oh, they got money. New day, new dollar. Is that a high grade helmet or is that just standard? No, it's just standard. Keep the pelts for now. And I'll end up taking all their money if I sell them. Bad. He needs more ammo. Again? Well, he goes through it fast. Yep. We're doing a lot of fighting. Yeah, so you did do a lot of fighting. That's, that's all we're doing. Just fighting, fighting. I'm just gonna leave all that ammo on Molly. Should be alright. Yeah, each one of these only has 20 shots, so... Mm-hmm. Need more fireplaces, I think. Maybe not. You know, there's another path you could take, too, instead of going to that uh, fog for that village there. You could try recruiting a few more people. Now that you're stronger and you have better equipment, you might be able to defend your town. Um, I think try we to could build that up a little probably bit. Probably defend against some people. We yeah. still got to do prayer day, right? The thing yeah, is, they were also just day. randomly raiding us. Like, we um, heard there were unchained women or something here, <laughs> and then they just think, attack you. I think those times they saw something. I don't know. Skeptical. Yeah. Guess those people all ran to go rest. Drop off our weapons. The 
backpack we don't need. Someone needs to put this on. It's got to be somebody that needs it. We actually only have two people or one person that's not wearing a shirt. Oh no, we have three. We're so close to having shirts for everyone. Check the Shinobi Thieves one more time for sales. Ooh. Dark leather shirt. I might actually take this. Learn to make your own, yeah. Right? Because these dark leather shirts are actually really good. Yeah, and yeah. once you level up, I mean, that does count as armor crafting, so you can turn around and sell those for a lot, too. Right. We'll take it. We have so much money right now. I guess if that's the case, also, you want to hang on to the leather instead of selling that. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be doing it super soon. We'll sell the leather when we need the money. We don't need the money right now, so... Mm -hmm. Is there anybody? Ban, do you want a bigger backpack? No, I'm fine with the small one. All I need is stuff for holding medicine. <sighs> Literally the only guy without a bigger backpack. <laughs> it's gonna drive me nuts. I don't want you looting stuff with that guy anyway, because then you just end up picking up swords and stuff. Eh. Okay. Uh, Flan, does this armor have negative effects for you? Martial arts doesn't matter. Dodge, crossbow, stealth is not great, but it's not terrible. Eh. These are better than heart protectors, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Because they just cover a lot more. Actually get some arm coverage and more of your stomach. And heart protectors mm -hmm. don't do anything, so we're going to buy both of those. Just not sure who I'm going to give them to just yet. I always throw them in the placeholders, I guess, for now. Let's do that. This is just standard grade. Garbage. Oh, this is a really good katana. Well, it's a blue katana. It's not a rusty garbage katana. Eh. Do we really need the upgrade? Fumin, you got 0 0.7, 0 0.9. This is much better. Was that shirt down there good? Uh, no, it's shoddy, dark leather. Oh. Yeah. All right. Who's wearing this? You're not. I want to... Yeah, we'll do it. We'll do one on this guy. We have a Ruka, a high-grade one. Level her up a little bit. And I guess something special will get a better armor. We're almost done getting rid of all of the heart protectors. Well, Flan still has a heart protector. Flan, you're going to get a better piece of armor. Eh, it's probably going to slow you down a little bit for now, but... I'll give you the high grade one. All right. One, two, three heart protectors. And then eventually we gotta get rid of all those janky pants that we have. This is a good spot to pause the stream though, before we go out and do something else. So this is gonna be the end of this recording and then we'll start the stream back up again. Because I do feel like continuing this for a little bit longer. So we'll be back in a minute. 